Okay, so you can see right here you have pyrite and calcopyrite mineralization. Here you got pyrite mineralization. These are from a couple showings down the road. Uh, we're about 500 meters away from them. We just discovered this new slough pile. And you have a uh, contact zone right here. You can see running 45 degrees. And uh, you have a calcite vein, a uh, pink colored calcite vein in there, uh, which we're just gonna go up there and get a quick sample of and uh, see if we can see anything in that. So to my right, you have a bunch of Gaussian showings. To the left, you have some Gaussian and you have um, a bunch of uh, small deposits that are uh, exposed all along the road for a section of two, 300 meters. So while well, my prospecting partner is up there getting a sample, just thought I'd uh, show a quick thing. That mountain up there has uh, a couple pretty big deposits uh, with gold, silver, copper, lead, zinc. And uh, we have those claims up there. On the other side of that mountain, you have a placer deposit which we discovered, and then you have uh, the headwaters of a river coming down from there, and that river flows for about 50 kilometers, and we have claims on that, and there's also a plaster deposit there. So once we get gate access, we're gonna be going up there. That's probably gonna be a few months away. Um, takes a little time to get the uh, logging companies to get us access. All right, so uh, the reason why we took this sample is because uh, it's a contact zone and uh, calcite is often associated with gold and other minerals. So we have a sample here. We're going to save this out later and uh, send it in. So we'll post the assay results after.